Hello ladies and gentlemen and welcome to another tournament. It is uh, the second part of this tournament too. It is going to be Marcus versus Christopher. And this is definitely going to be a good one. Um, so like I said, 15 versus 15. Uh, as they get eliminated, I will let you know what team they're on. Um, so yeah, we got uh, Marcus and Christopher in our second matchup here. And also, just a reminder, I do three finishers. I do 30-second um, inter entrance intervals. So, it's going to be a good one. We're starting off with Brady. And who is Brady going to be facing off with is the question. <laughs> oh, wow. Wow. Yeah, not not good luck there. Tyson Fury is here. Tyson Fury. So, there's a lot of different characters on here, and it's actually very a good variety on both sides. Um, so we'll see who takes this one. Uh, the first one was pretty close. Uh, we'll see if this one continues on with that. And oh my goodness, right out of the gate, Tyson Fury eliminated. So that is a loss for Marcus. And Brady's the one to do it. I never saw that one coming. I mean, that's kind of, and uh-oh, we got Morgan at number three. And yes, we did give him Rey Mysterio moves. Why not? We had to. So it's already uh, and Brady taking down Tyson Fury in the opening. Uh, didn't see that one coming. Did not see that one coming. And we got bat faster. <laughs> There's a reason why they called him that. They're trying to avoid asterisks. Uh, smart move. Very smart move. I'll give you credit there. Um, that's not his name. But uh, pretty good. I, I can't lie. Pretty good on the name there. You got to do what you got to do to avoid those asterisks. Uh, those asterisks are terrible. And number five is Jack Sparrow. I don't know if we'll ever see that character again, unfortunately. But um, yeah, we got him at number five here. And Vecna is number six from Stranger Things. I'm a big Vecna fan. I I think that character is just amazing, and um, the actor that plays him does a wonderful job as Vecna. And the whole symbolism of Vecna is just excellent. Love that villain. He's a he's a great villain. He's probably one of my favorite villains. It's between him and Homelander right now. And Brady's been eliminated, so... Um, Crap. Where is he? He's hiding. There he is. It's on Team Marcus's team. So that's two eliminations there. And Rorschach is number seven. Number seven is Rorschach. Yeah, Vecna and Homelander would have to be my two new favorite villains um, of on, on TV right now. 
It's definitely between the two. I actually don't know which one's better. Uh, because they're they're really great, both of them are. Um, great shows have great villains. That's just a something you have to have. And as much as I love Marvel and stuff, like um, sometimes they don't have good villains. They've had some great ones though too. But uh, some of the weaker movies had some of the worst villains. And Sparrow's getting double teamed here. Number eight is Marvin the Martian. And Sparrow is done. And that is a loss for Marcus. So three already for Team Marcus. And um, Yeah, Freeman with a nice move. <laughs> Number nine is uh, Fox McCloud. And Marvin, well, he might be safe actually. This has been interesting. <laughs> wow. Morgan with his moves. I, I gave him great moves. And there goes Vecna. So that is a loss for Marcus. His team is really getting hit. Agent Cooper number 10. Marvin taking down the, the big guy. <laughs> Bat faster. <laughs> wow, clever. Clever, clever, clever. And there he goes. So uh, that is a loss for Marcus again. And it is not looking good for his team. Five already. Uh, but I still see some that haven't arrived yet. Um... Who was that? Crap, I can't see you. I didn't see who it was. Some got somebody got thrown out there. I'll have to figure it out. I, I don't recall who it could be. I was I was looking down at the list. Number 12 is Hopper. Hopper. I'm trying to see who, who it could have been. Um, I 
Well, no, Fox McCloud's gone. Okay, yeah. That, that must have been him. Like, that's a loss for Christopher. That's a first loss for Christopher, too. Five to one. It's Marcus versus Christopher. So Christopher has lost one. It's uh, Fox McCloud. That's the one I missed. I don't know how I missed that. I kind of, I guess I was looking down at the sheet. And Lamar Davis is 13. Talk about annoying. Him and Lester between the two. Oh man, Agent Cooper with that kick. And there goes Rorschach. And that is a loss for Marcus again. And 14, Davy Jones. Davy Jones in the house. Freeman trying to drop kick didn't even work against Davy. And Argyle is number 15. I, I'm not a big fan of this guy. Um, he's all right. He's got a couple funny lines and Stranger Things, but Argyle is here. He's kind of a newer character, just like uh, Eddie was. And there goes Hopper. Hopper has been eliminated. That's another loss for Marcus. Wow. And that's seven now. And Argyle is going to be joining. That is for Marcus again. It is eight to one right now. That's crazy. I could have missed one, uh, but I don't think I did. Uh, I think we got Fox McCloud, and that's the only one Christopher has lost. And uh, make it Marvin the Martian as well. So he, he's lost him. So two losses for Christopher. And there goes Davy. Wow. Davy is done. And that is a loss for Christopher. And number 16 is Ron Swanson from Parks and Rec. Still haven't seen that. I still have not seen that. Yeah, I think Morgan's done here. It was, it, hey, it was fun while it lasted, but there's no way you survived that. And that is a loss for Christopher. So finally, Christopher's getting some losses here, but it's still eight to four, big, a big margin between the two. And Sam Loomis is 17.
Wow, look at Lamar. <laughs> and Myers is 18. Oh my goodness, if we got a Loomis versus Myers. That'd be awesome. And by the way, um, they're on the same team. Wow. What's the odds of that? And Swanson's in trouble. And there goes Swanson. So that's another loss for Marcus. Makes it nine to four now. And it is not looking good for Team Marcus. I gotta be honest. It's not looking good at all. Candyman is number 19. Because a lot of these people in the rain are on Team Marcus. So. Chuck Norris is number 20. <laughs> wow. <laughs> I would love to see Myers versus Loomis. We've got to have it. I don't know if they're going to meet up, though, in this. They're in at the same time, though. Scorpion is just handing out choke slams like there's no tomorrow. How about another one? Why not? Why not? Meyer's still in this. Steve Harvey, 21. Harvey is 21. Nice headbutt there by Myers. And Lamar eliminates Loomis. That's a loss for Marcus. So he's got five people left. It is not looking good for Team Marcus. 2K is after him again, it seems like. But it's not over. It's not over until it's over. He still has five people in this. And uh, some of them are really good. Leon is 22. Leon at There goes Scorpion. Another loss for Marcus. It's 
Steve might be joining. Nope. Oh my goodness. <laughs> Myers has Norris. He has taken out Norris. It's a loss for Christopher. And Hades takes out Cooper. And that's a loss for Marcus. So he's got three left. Got Cobra here. I I had to put down the last name because because I I thought it would be a uh, uh, Commander Cobra. And there goes Harvey. So that's a loss for Christopher. And Jeffrey is 25. Jeffrey's been knocked out. So that's a loss for Christopher. So he's starting to lose some, but it's still a big difference between both teams. And Lamar is out. So that is a loss for Marcus. He's down to two. Oh, and he lost Myers. I didn't even see that. I missed it. I don't know how. So he's actually down to one. Man, this is not looking good for Team Marcus. He has one left. And 2K definitely has caused this. There's no debate about it. Absolutely none. And there goes Hades. That's a loss for Christopher. And Dark, Dark Queen is here. And, oh, that double team. And there, I think that was Eddie. Is that Eddie? Yeah. And that's another one for Christopher. So he's starting to lose some. But, like I said, it's basically 14 to 9 right now. <laughs> so there's a big difference there. Especially where we're at. Hannibal's 28. Oh, nice kick. Oh, man, that was nice. And Cobra done. Lost for Christopher, so now he's down to five. If my counts are correct. No, maybe not, because Candyman did. Yeah, Candyman got thrown out. Vegeta's 29. Marcus is down to one, but he hasn't arrived yet, so it looks like he's going to be number 30, which is really good, actually, for Team Marcus. And the odds are stacked against him right now. So there's four left on Team Christopher. They're all in the ring. And uh, one for Team Marcus left. And that is Aragon, so that's pretty good. 
he's probably better than all four of these guys. But the, the question is, can he survive? Because his odds, uh, Marcus has a 20% chance of winning this thing. Uh-oh. Somebody gonna get, oh man. Electric got the Claymore. Wow, what a nice uh, recovery there by Leon. We are down to five. What a competitive match this has been. Well, not I wouldn't say competitive because 2K has really uh, went against Marcus for sure. Um, he still has one good guy left. And uh, this guy can really come through maybe. He did come in at number 30. And there you go. So he has now made his odds 25%. Went from 20 to 25. And Leon is done. So, lost for Christopher there. Christopher still got three. And uh-oh, Vegeta. Aragon's still in it. Oh man, look at Lecter with that Seth Rollins move. Is Hannibal going to be done here? He is hanging on. Oh, wow. I don't know how he made it, but he did. Yeah, he got a headbutt there. <laughs> Look at Aragon. How about another Claymore? And Vegeta is hanging on. Ah, he's made it somehow. I don't know how. But he did. Yeah, Darkwing versus uh, Vegeta here too. Again, and once again, Vegeta's still in. So we are still down to these four. They have been putting on a performance and a half.
And Darkwing is going after Aragon. Will this be the end of Team Marcus? And Aragon's the, the only hope left for Team Marcus here. Darkwing can't get him. Seems to be having some trouble here. N none of these guys want to leave. I wonder how Myers fell out. I, I may have saw it. I, I just don't recall who got him. I may have been looking down at the, sh the sheet. Uh-oh, and Vegeta takes out Team Marcus. So it looks like, once again, 2K was very unfair to Team Marcus. But, hey, rules are rules. Uh, it happens to everyone. But it seems to happen to Team Marcus more than anybody. <laughs> but Chris, uh, Team Christopher wins. But the question is, who is going to represent him in that win? Vegeta was the one with the final blow on Team Marcus. So we're down to Hannibal, Vegeta, and Darkwing. And Vegeta out. So they're down to Hannibal and Darkwing here. What in the world was that? Yeah. I don't know if that was a smart idea. Oh, he may take it here. Oh, perfect. Well, maybe not. <laughs> and, oh man, Hannibal striking big there on Darkwing. That move is just brutal because it just like it runs your neck into the ropes. And again, why not? Why not another one? Darkwing has Hannibal into the corner. Could this be it? Does he have him? I'm telling you, man. Hannibal is always hanging on. This is just incredible. Twice he has survived. And we're down to Darkwing versus Hannibal. And yeah, Hannibal's gonna take it. Wow, just a great performance by him, and what a great match. But uh, Team Christopher will move on to the Elite Eight. Congratulations to Team Christopher. But I gotta tell your team this. Uh, yeah, this is a definite, a most definite. Uh, he hasn't done it yet, but I know he's gonna do it. You're not going to WrestleMania. There is no way you eat people, okay? We don't want to, we, you know, we have concession stands. We got hot dogs, we got hamburgers, got popcorn. People is not on the menu at WrestleMania, so you are not going. There's no way you're going. Can you just imagine him just sitting there and all of a sudden he bites someone's cheek? No way, Jose, are you going. There's no way you're going to WrestleMania. Even if you started at number one, I wouldn't allow it. Because you were out there, man. You need help. That's what you need. But anyway, I hope you all enjoyed it. And it looks like Team Christopher is going to move on. And, uh, yeah. yeah. 2K was definitely not in Marcus's favor. There's no doubt about it. But you can't take it away from Team Christopher. They still won the match. I mean, no matter what you want to call it. But hope you guys enjoy it. And I will see you all later.